Hey guys, it's me, Macy here, and today I will be doing a makeup tutorial. And I haven't posted a video in like three months, and I am so sorry for that. But last time I checked my YouTube channel, I had 81 subscribers. I don't know if that's gone down because sometimes when I don't post in a while, I lose some subscribers, which is really bad. So, guys, definitely stay subs. I don't know why I just did a thumbs up. Definitely stay subscribed because I will let you know if I'm gonna just stop doing YouTube altogether, but that probably won't be for a while because I love making videos and I have all this makeup, so why I need someone to show it to. <laughs> so yeah, I am so sorry that I didn't upload videos, but thank you so much for getting me to 80 subscribers. So our next goal is 90 and then it will be 100. And guys, I am super excited because we are so close to 100. It's kind of really weird because I never thought like I would have like 100 subscribers on YouTube but we're not there yet so I can't get my help with yet but we did get to 80 so definitely try to get us to 90 this time but today I will be doing an eyeshadow look using the Smashbox hashtag shape matters palette and I got this last week and I haven't used it at all because I just got back from Florida because it was my spring break and I am in love with this palette. I haven't even used it yet, but they have stuff for your brows, this is for your face, and then this is for your eyes. And before I start this makeup look, which I haven't even planned what I'm going to do, I'm just going to kind of wing it, I'm going to tell you a few things that I like about this palette. One, it is really big, so it comes with a lot of things, but it is not good for traveling, obviously, because it's huge. Hey, it's here. <laughs> Um, there is a huge mirror, and it's a super clear mirror. Um, it comes with a brush. Let me show you. Can get it out. Um, it's a two-sided brush with an angle side for your brows, and then, like, a flat, fluffy side for your eyeshadow. And then, what I think is really cool, let me just show you here. This is, like, the eyebrow wax, and it has, like, a special little thing that it covers up. Like, I've never seen that before on a palette. It came with this little, like, this little pouch thing, if you want to call it. It's actually downstairs. But what you can do is you can scan the paper that is in the pouch on your phone, and it will give you a tutorial on how to use the things in the palette. So there's one for your eyebrows, your eyeshadow, and your face. And the last thing that I like about this palette, which I probably will have more as I use this palette, um, but on the back, it shows you all of the. Can you show me that? It shows you all of the names and what they are, so that you don't forget the names. And I think that's really nice because a lot of palettes just have this little plastic thing, which this one has it too. But then you always, I always like lose it or throw it away, and then I don't know the colors anymore. So I like how that has it on the back, and it's like all laid out and everything. So yeah, that is what I like about this palette, and now we're just going to get right into it, and I'm winging it like I said before, so I have no clue what I'm going to do. I will probably have to get into some other makeup products just to kind of start out with, and I'm first going to start off with concealer, and I'm going to use this True Match. I recently, it's by uh, L'Oreal. That is my concealer, and now we're gonna move on to powder. I'm gonna use this e.l.f. Elf Flawless Face Powder. Whoopsies. And guys, I'm so excited because- Okay, now we're finally going to get into the palette. The only sad thing is that this doesn't come like with a con like a face brush. Um, but that would be like way too big to be able to put in this palette. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to, I'm not gonna do a contour, I'm just gonna do a bronzer because you just don't want to see me do a contour because it's really bad. So I'm using 
this color right here, which is the bronzer. And I'm just gonna put that kind of in the three motion. This palette also does not come with blush either, which is kind of a downside, but you know. Now I'm gonna go into the highlighter, which they have like, oh my gosh, this is like so looks Don't look in the mirror, okay. So they have like two highlighters. There's a glow, which is, let me see. Let me look at this. Oh, I can just look on the back, okay. The glow is this one. This is the glow and then the highlight is right here, but I'm gonna use the glow and, and an angled brush. I'm putting that on my cheekbones, bridge of my nose, middle of the forehead, and a little bit on my chin. That is all I'm going to use in the face section for this palette. And I'm gonna go into some blush. You know what, guys? I'm going to use a tint. This is a lip tint, but you can use it as a cheek tint. I got it in my Ipsy, maybe. But I love this so much. And I'm just going to kind of draw a little line. That was so much, oh my gosh. This is gonna turn out so bad, guys. I've used this before, but the side's gonna be like so bright. Look in the mirror. Okay, oh, it's not that bad. But it is really bright. Okay. Let's not put that much on the other side, Macy. Okay. Now I'm going to move on to eyebrows. I'm going to use this bottom one, which is soft brown and the angled brush that is Normally after I do my eyebrows it looks really odd to me because my my eyebrows should be dark because of my hair but they're really sparse so they look when i fill them in they look really weird so i'm just gonna brush this out with a clean toothbrush that i use for my eyebrows You've seen me use this in other videos but does my eyebrows don't they look really weird okay this is not working out for me so far <sighs> okay now we're gonna move on to on to eyeshadow and i think i'm gonna stick with like this kind of row, like the top row, and then this row right here because these ones are a little bit intense. Okay, so what we're gonna do is I'm going to take the eyeshadow brush that came on this side and I'm gonna take vanilla, which is right here, and I'm gonna put that like from my eyelashes all the way up to my brow row. Now I'm going to take the same brush and I'm gonna go in with strip, stri striped, striped, which is the second one right here. And I'm just gonna put that on my lid, my eyelid. Okay, now I'm going to take a fluffy brush this did not come with like a fluffy brush, it just came with kind of like a flat fluffy, fluffy brush, so I'm using a like blending brush here. I'm, I was thinking I was going to use this one, but now that I look at it, it's really dark, so I think I'm going to dab this and then like do some of the contour. 
So I'm putting a little bit of the dark brown on and then the contour. So I'm gonna put that in my crease. I'm going for a natural look. And that is what that looks like. As you can see, it's just a really light look. Okay. So now I'm just going to take the dark color on the bottom here. And this is in Snatra. Small. Um, and I'm going to take a little bit of that, tap off the access, and I'm just going to put that very deep into the crease, only on the outer part of my eye. And as you can see, we'll kind of look like that, so then you can just kind of close your eye and then blend it out some more. So, that is the eyeshadow and now I'm going to take a okay, there goes my toothbrush um just another flat brush and I'm gonna take this gold this gold color here and this is in champagne it's more of a gold than a champagne color though and I'm gonna put that let me find out what side I put it okay I'm gonna put that on my inner corner and like the inner part of my eyelid kind of give it a little bit of a shimmer and you could totally just use like a white and do this if you wanted to go for a completely matte eyeshadow look but I always like a little bit of shimmer in my makeup looks okay and I think I am officially done with this palette and I'm gonna have to get to some of my other products because I need mascara so now I'm just going to curl my eyelashes. And now I'm going to take the Their Real Mascara from Benefit and put that on. Okay, and I think we're done with the eyes, and now we're going to move on to the lips. So I think I'm going to use that same lip tint. This is called Perry's Tint, by the way, from Perry Para. And I'm going to use that on my lips. I really like this lip tint, by the way. Okay, so this video was very long, but kind of like the overall review of this palette, um, I really like it. The reason, it's probably not the palette that makes the face products not show up as well, it's probably just the operator here. Um, but I really like, they're not, like the shadow, like the powders aren't too chalky or anything. Um, I really like the highlight and the eyeshadows and everything like that. I didn't use the brow wax today. Um, but I'm sure that would be just as well too because it's just a wax. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys like this. Definitely give a thumbs up down below and subscribe to my YouTube channel again down below. Hit that big red button down there and we can get to 90 subscribers, which is a lot of people watching my videos and I'm very thankful for you. Definitely recommend you go out and buy this palette. It was like $56 maybe. I don't know, it's a little bit expensive, but it has everything you need, and it's a really nice palette, and it will probably last you a really long time. Um, so, yeah, and if you order it off the Sephora website, you get three free samples. Keep that in mind. Um, so, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have a wonderful day, and comment down below other video ideas. I'm thinking of doing a What's in My Birchbox slash Ipsy every month and showing you what's in my birch box and ipsy and i've come down below if you want me to do that also tell me your favorite ice cream flavor i think i'm gonna start doing like you know question of the video question of the video what's your favorite ice cream flavor question of the video okay so yeah that is enough i hope you guys liked it and i will see you in my next video bye